Welcome to the Al Jazari channel, where you will learn capacity planning as a core operations management activity. The processing requirement calculation was explained in a previous video with an example. Here another example is solved. A manager must decide which type of equipment to buy, type A or type B. Type A equipment costs $15,000 each, and type B costs $11,000 each. The equipment can be operated 8 hours a day, 250 days a year. Either machine can be used to perform two types of chemical analysis, C1 and C2. Annual service requirements and processing times are shown in the following table. Which type of equipment should be purchased, and how many of that type will be needed? The goal is to minimize total purchase cost. At the beginning calculate the total processing time of each analysis type needed by each type of equipment by multiplying the annual volume by the processing time per analysis. For analysis, C1 with equipment, A, the total processing time equals 1,200 times 1 equal 1,200. For analysis, C2 with equipment, A, the total processing time equals 900 times 3 equal 2,700. For analysis, C1 with equipment, B, the total processing time equals 1,200 times 2 equal 2,400. For analysis, C2 with equipment, B, the total processing time equals 900 times 2 equal 1,800. Then calculate the total processing time for each machine. For machine A, it is 1,200 plus 2,700 equal 3,900. For machine B, it is 2,400 plus 1,800 equal 4,200. Now calculate the available processing time of the equipment by multiplying the number of operating hours per day by the number of operating days per year. That is 8 times 250 equals 2,000 hours. After that, calculate the required equipment of each type by dividing the total processing time for each machine by the available processing time of the equipment. For type A equipment, the required equipment equals 3,900 divided by 2,000 equals 1.95 approximately equals two pieces of equipment. While for type B equipment, the required equipment equals 4,200 divided by 2,000 equals 2.1 approximately equals three pieces of equipment. After calculating the required equipment of each type, compute the corresponding purchasing cost by multiplying the number of pieces by the cost of one piece of equipment. For type A, the purchasing cost equals 2 times 15,000 equals $30,000. While for type B, the purchasing cost equals 3 times 11,000 equals $33,000. As the goal is to minimize the total purchasing cost, two pieces of type A would have sufficient capacity to handle the load at a lower cost than three pieces of type B. In this video, an example shows how to calculate processing requirements is solved. In the next video, more problems will be explained so stay tuned and do not forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the alarm to be notified of the new videos. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, so press like and share it. See you again.